video I'm going to show you how you can get the multi-step pattern brushes to work seamlessly with each other. There is a trick to this that I'm going to show you. You can get these brushes to work seamlessly with each other so you can make a beautiful multi-step pattern. To start, you start a new canvas in any size you want. I'm going to do 3600 pixels at 300 dpi. And the size of the canvas does not matter for this, you can choose any canvas you want. To get these brushes to work together, you need to make sure that they're exactly the same size. Uh, and to make this exact, you can't just use the slider as it is, because that's not exact enough. This will cause the pattern to be slightly off each other. Instead, choose the size that you would like. I'm going to do plaid 1. And say I want the size to be 20. If I do 20 as it is, then they won't exactly line up. I do 20. They will be slightly off. Instead, choose a size that you would like. I'm going to do 20. And then I'm going to slide my pencil out. It's a bit tricky. And go up. to 20. I'm gonna go down so that I get, barely get 19 and then get 20. And then I'm just gonna fill my whole canvas. Then I'm gonna go to a new layer and a new color and choose brush 2. And I'm gonna make that one Go to down to 19 and 20, and then I can paint that layer in. Then I'm gonna do a new layer and a new color, and do step three, and I'm gonna do the same size change again. Go down to 19, and then barely up to 20. And then I can fill in the next square. So as you can see, this pattern is now perfectly seamless. And the brushes work exactly as they should. And I can even do step four. Let's do a black. That's not a black. And we're going to go down again. Nineteen and I ran out of space. Sometimes you do that. Nineteen twenty, and then I can add in and there you have it. A perfect seamless multi-step pattern. Have fun experimenting.